love this show. Yeah, me too. It's okay. Hi, kids. Hey, Hi, Mom. Mom. Grace and I are heading out to run some errands. Can you tell your father? I think he's in the basement. Sure, Mom. No problem. What's Dad doing in the basement? Well, we wanted to put up Christmas decorations today. <gasps> Christmas decorations? Yay! I love Christmas. I know you do, honey. We all do. I shouldn't be too long. Can you just let your father know? Sure thing, Mom. No problem, Mom. All right, see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Bye, Mom. Oh, oh, ah, ah. A big shout out to some of our amazing fans for requesting their Cardo family decorates for Christmas. Courtney Hanses, Bratislav Georgievic, and I apologize if I pronounced your name wrong, Tammy Amberg, Kelly Turgeon, Jody Rogers Kent, Yori Waka Bicky, Leia's Fabulous World, LPS Ginger and Chocolate Shows, Fun with Liv, Lizzie the Elephant Lover, Alyssa Tobias, Sia Carva Fan, and LPS Honey Bear, along with a big thank you to everyone who watches and comments on our videos. We hope you love this one. Ricardo Family Christmas Decorating Disaster. Almost. Oh, made it. This box gets heavier every year. I think we keep adding decorations to it. Hey, Marcel, why don't you give your dad a hand? No problem, Dad. Is it time to decorate, Dad? Yay! Yeah, all right. Where do you want it, Dad? Uh, maybe just in front of the TV there? I think we're gonna put the tree right there. Okay, cool. Perfect. Thanks, Marcel. No problem, Dad. You guys all set to decorate? Yeah, Dad, totally. I want to decorate, Dad. Can I put the star on top of the tree, please? Please, please? Sure, Jasmine. Hey, wait a sec. Where's your mom and Grace? I thought she was going to help me bring the tree up. Oh, right. Sorry, Dad. Mom said she and Grace had to run some errands. Oh. Please, Dad, let's decorate the tree. Come on. Well, honey, we can't decorate the tree without your mom and Grace here. But you can help me decorate outside if you want while we wait. No, that's okay, Dad. It's kind of cold out. Yeah, I don't really feel like going outside right now, Dad. Marcel, what about you? Maybe I'll go and hang out with Shay for a bit before we start decorating. Is that okay? Yeah, I guess that's okay. Can you help me bring the tree up first, though? Sure thing, Dad. Come on, Marcel. To the basement. Johnny? Yeah? Did you want to go play upstairs in our room? Okay, sure. Look out, guys. I gotta go help Dad bring the tree up. Pivot, pivot. Good job, Marcel. This way. Which way, Dad? I think it should go more this way. Mm, I was thinking more this way. No, I think it should go more this way. Then it's not too close. Move it back this way. I don't know, Dad. It might look better back this way. There. Perfect. What do you think? Looks good, Dad. Yep, I think so too. This is my favorite time of year. Yeah, I know, Dad. You sure you don't want to help your old dad with the decorating outside? Uh, I think I'll go hang out with Shay. We'll decorate the tree later, right? When Mom's home? She shouldn't be too late. Maybe a couple hours. Okay, I'll just see you later, Dad. Thanks for helping me with the tree. No problem. I can't believe no one wanted to help me decorate outside. I'm gonna put the lights up and put the wreath out. Oh yeah, a wreath. Oh, I'll go grab it. <sighs> Back down in the basement I go. There, the wreath is all set up. It's looking good. Mm -hmm. Now, where to put the garland and the lights? It looked really pretty from the top of the roof. It's a little bit tall and sometimes I put lights up there but not the garland. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Hey, Dad. Huh? Dad, up here. Dad. Oh, hey, Johnny. Hey, Dad. Hi, Dad. Hi, Jasmine. Is it time to decorate the tree yet? Yeah, Dad, come on. We want to decorate the tree. Hold on there, kids. Your mom's not home yet. You can't trim the tree without your mother. Oh, okay. You guys want to help your old dad decorate the outside? No. Okay, just thought I'd ask. I'm sure she'll be back soon. Okay, Dad. All right, Dad. Well, I guess the garland and lights aren't going to hang themselves. Better get up there. I'm a wee bit scared of heights. Well, here goes nothing. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Here we go. Looking good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa that was a close one. I almost fell. Don't want to do that. Gotta get this attached. I'm gonna get this all done before Lucy gets home so then we can decorate the tree. All done, Gracie. Oh, look. Aw, your father was decorating the front. It looks amazing. 
Oh, it looks like he's still finishing up the lights. Hi, honey. What? Hey, Lucy. How's it going? It's going good. How's it look? It looks wonderful. I love it. Oh, but you're home now. We can decorate the tree. Yay. Once you're done up here, I guess then we can do that. Okay, I'll finish up as fast as I can. Honey, just please be careful, okay? I will, Lucy. Don't worry. Come down when you're done. Sounds good. When is mom gonna get home? I don't know, Jasmine. I'm bored. Yeah, me too. I really want to decorate the tree. I know. That's one of my favorite things to do at Christmas. Yeah, me too. <sighs> what do you want to do? I don't know. Hey, wait, we didn't write our letters to Santa yet. Oh, right. Yeah, let's do that. Hey, guys, I'm back. Yay, Mom. Hi, Mom. Does this mean we get to decorate the tree now? Yeah, we just have to wait on your father now. He just wants to finish up decorating outside. Awesome. Can we make hot chocolate and have cookies and listen to Christmas carols? <laughs> you bet, sweetie. That's what we always do. Help me out. Ah! <gasps> Rick! Oh my gosh! You guys, wait here! Did Dad just fall? Yeah, I think so. Rick! Rick, honey! Rick! Come on, let's go! Mom? Mom? Is that okay? Johnny, Jasmine, go get your grandmother, quick! Okay, okay Mom. Mom. Hello, 911? Yes. This is Lucy Ricardo. I live at 321 Willow Park Place. Please, send an ambulance. My husband has fallen off the roof. He's breathing but unconscious. Okay, thank you. Oh. Hold on, Rick. Just hold on. The ambulance will be here soon. <gasps> Please hurry. Don't worry, ma'am. We'll take good care of him. Are you riding in the ambulance with us? Yes, yes I am. All right, let's just load him up and you can hop in. Thank you. Mom. Yes, Jasmine, honey? I want to go with you. I want to stay with Dad. Yeah, Mom. I want to stay with Dad, too. No, guys. You stay with Grandma, okay? Yeah, kids. You stay with Grandma. Lucy, honey. Please call us with any kind of information. I will, Judy. I will. You guys be good for Grandma, okay? Okay, Mom. He's all loaded up. You can hop right in. Thank you so much. Jasmine, honey, try not to worry too much. Let's just wait and hear what your mom says once they get to the hospital, okay? Yeah, but Grandma, he wasn't waking up. I know, sweetie, I know. But he was breathing, so that's a good thing. Grandma, look, it's Marcel. Hey, did I just see an ambulance? What's going on? Oh, Marcel, it's just awful. Dad fell off the roof. He wasn't waking up and Mom had to call an ambulance and they just took him away and they're going to the hospital and we don't know if he's going to be okay. What? Dad fell off the roof? How? Oh, when he was trying to put up the lights. It's all my fault. I should have stayed to help him. No, honey, it's not your fault. It was an accident. We can't plan these things. No, but he had asked for my help and I told him no. Things happen, honey. I'm worried too. Let's just wait to see what your mom says. I know she will call the moment she talks to the doctor. All right. Okay. Okay, Grandma. Ooh. Hello? Oh, hi, Judy. Yeah, no, Rick's okay. He's stable. And they're taking him for some x-rays to make sure that nothing severe was broken. But I think he's gonna be okay. Yes, we are very lucky, aren't we? Yeah, I think you can bring the kids down in a little bit. Hopefully he'll be awake by then. I'm just waiting for them to bring him back. Oh, I gotta go, Judy. I think he's coming now. I'll just see you later. Bye. 
Hi, doctor. Is everything okay? What did the x-ray show? Well, he dislocated his shoulder, so we fixed that out, but it's gonna be sore for a little while and he should take it easy. Okay, he still hasn't woken up. And we're just gonna wait and see. He might be concussed, but there's no fractures of the skull or anything like that, so we'll just have to take it easy. But I do think he'll make a full recovery. Oh, thank goodness. If he wakes up, just buzz the office and I'll come straight away. Thank you so much, doctor. I was so worried. Not a problem. Oh, Rick, what am I gonna do with you? Just happy that you're okay, but please wake up. Come back to your family. Come on, kids. Oh, Lucy, honey. Judy. Hi, Mom. Hi, Jasmine. Hi, Mom. How's Dad? Hi, Johnny. Well, he's stable. Hi, Mom. I'm sorry. What are you talking about, Marcel? This wasn't your fault. I should have been helping Dad. He asked and I just said no. Oh, honey, it's okay. Help! Help! Hang on there, Gracie. You wanna go down? Help! Okay, hang on. There you go, Gracie. <laughs> you stay close now. But, Mom, if I had helped Dad, then maybe he wouldn't have fallen. Oh, Marcel, I already told you. Accidents happen. Yeah, Marcel, it's not your fault. Dad just fell. Honey, don't beat yourself up. It was not your fault, okay? All right, Mom. Dada! Hello, tiny person. <gasps> Rick! You're awake! Hmm? Hello? Do I know you? <laughs> Good one, Dad. No, really. Do I know you? Oh, my goodness. Um, Marcel, can you run and get the doctor, please? Sure thing, Mom. Hey, am I in a hospital? What am I doing here? Am I okay? Did something happen? Yeah, it's okay, Rick. You are in the hospital. You had an accident. Rick? Why do you keep calling me Rick? Well, that's your name. Don't you remember? No. No, I don't. Dada! Yes, hi, tiny person. But I'm not your dada. Rick, you are. You're her dad. What? I'm a dad? I have a baby? This is too weird. Actually, dad, you have five kids. What? I have five kids? How is this possible? I'm still in college. Oh my goodness. Are you sure? Are you sure I have five kids? Yes, I'm very sure that you have five kids. Well, with who? Am I married? What's my wife like? Is she good looking? Ah, uh, Ricky, honey. Yes, you are married. You're married to Lucy here. Oh, I am? It's nice to meet you. Mom, what's wrong with dad? I think your father has amnesia. I'm a what now? Amnesia, Johnny. Sometimes it happens when people get hit on the head. It's like they can't remember. That is just weird. Whoa, I see someone's awake and how are things going? Um, not good, doctor. I think Rick has amnesia. Hmm, maybe I should examine him again. Kids, why don't we go wait outside? And then the doctor can look at your father. Okay, hope you feel better, Dad. Thank you, small child. I appreciate that. All right, small child. <laughs> Jasmine, wait. Oh, dear. Come on, Gracie. Come with Grandma. Grandma. That's right, honey. Grandma. Lucy, honey, we'll be just outside. Thank you, Judy. Okay, let's just take a quick look at you. Well, your pupils are dilated a little bit, but do you remember your name? I think my wife said my name was Rick. Yep, you're right. That's your name. Yep, my name's Rick. Do you remember your last name? Uh, Smith? No, it's definitely not Smith. What is the last thing that you remember? Um, I was getting ready for class in college and then waking up here and finding out I have five kids. Five kids! I gotta lay down. Five kids. I'm just a kid myself. Oh my gosh. Doctor, is this normal? It's like he lost the last 20 years. Well, I think he has a little bit of a concussion and there might be a bit of bruising or swelling on the brain from his fall. I was a little bit worried about that, but I had to wait for him to wake up to see if that happened. Is he gonna be okay? Okay. As the swelling goes down, he should regain his memory. Should? Well, nothing certain with a brain injury. Oh my goodness. Alright, so 
Where do we go from here? We'll keep him here overnight for sure. And then once he's ready to go home, I think the best thing to do would be just to live your life as normal as possible. Sometimes being in familiar places can kind of jumpstart memories. All right, I guess we'll just take him home when he's ready. Any other pain, Mr. Ricardo? Yeah, my shoulder hurts and my head's sore. What happened? Oh, you were putting up Christmas decorations outside our house and you fell. Christmas decorations? Yes. I'll be right back. I'm just gonna get some medicine for Mr. Ricardo. Okay, thank you. Are you sure I was putting up Christmas decorations? Yes, yes you were. You love putting up decorations. Never really considered myself to be a holiday type of guy. Well, you weren't really when we first met. You liked Christmas, but everything kind of changed once we had the kids and you just really got into it. I'm just really glad that you're okay, Rick. I was really nervous. Thank you, I guess. Lisa? It's Lucy. Sorry, Lucy. Right. And you're my wife. Yes. Okay. Wow. I have a beautiful wife. <laughs> That's the Rick I know. You should lay down and get some rest. Yeah, I'm kind of tired. My head hurts. Okay, you lay down. I'll be here if you need me. Thanks. You're really nice. I must be lucky. <laughs> yes, you are. You just get some sleep. Thank you, Lucy. If you need anything, just call. I will. Well, Mom, what'd the doctor say? Seems like he does have a bit of amnesia. He can come home in a few days, and the doctor said just to try to remind him of who he was, and hopefully everything will be okay. Oh my goodness. And here we are, back home sweet home. Wow, you have a lovely home, Lucy. It's beautiful. Thanks, Rick, but it's... It's your home too. Oh, right, I guess it is. I just really don't remember any of it. It's okay, hopefully everything will come back to you soon. That would be nice. I feel like I'm missing a part of me. Well, you kind of are. Um, so this is the kitchen. Help yourself to whatever you want. Oh, okay, great. And then the living room is this way. And maybe we should call the kids because I know that they really want to see you. Right, our kids. Kids, guess who's here? Hey mom, what is it? <gasps> dad! Hi dad! Hey Johnny, how are you doing man? Doing good dad, how are you doing? So happy you're home? Thanks. Dad! Hi! Hi dad, miss you so much! Oh careful honey, watch out for your dad's shoulder, remember? Oh right, sorry. That's okay, it felt kind of nice to have a hug. Dad, you're home. Yeah, I guess I'm home. Doctor said I'm good enough to come back. That's great, Dad. Dad, I'm so happy you're home. Me too. Can we decorate the Christmas tree now? Please, 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 Dad. Mom said we had to wait until you're home, and now you're home. Oh, sure. Go ahead. You guys didn't need to wait for me. But we want to do it with you. Yeah, Dad. Oh, um, I'm not really big into Christmas decorating. What? What do you mean? You love Christmas. It's your favorite time of the year. It is? Well, normally. Oh, I think I'm kind of tired. Would you guys be okay if I just skip tree decorating this time? Um, of course. Sure. But mom. Jasmine, honey, if your father doesn't want to do it, we can't force him to. Everything's still kind of new for him. Okay. I'm sorry. Maybe there's something else that we could do another time. Oh, like bake Christmas cookies? Yeah, we love doing that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, dad. Christmas cookies. Uh, sure. I guess guess we could make some. You guys will have to teach me how. I'm not really a good cook. What? What do you mean you're not a good cook? Uh, yeah, I don't really know how to cook. Uh, Dad, you cook everything here. You cook all the big dinners, you make our lunches. Yeah, and usually every night you figure out dinner. What? I do? I know how to cook? Yeah, you're a really good cook, actually. Okay, I had no idea. <laughs> ah, what is that? Looks like a mouse. Oh, that's just our dog, Cupcake. You love cupcake. Really? I never really considered myself a small dog type of guy. <laughs> nice doggy. Nice doggy. Okay, cupcake. That's okay. Okay, go on. <laughs> oh, it's okay, cupcake. <laughs> Sorry, cupcake. I've just never met you before. Oh, dear. I'm feeling a little bit tired. Would you mind showing me where I could lay down for a little bit? My head's starting to hurt. Of course. It's right down here. Sorry, kids. This way? Yep, it's right in through there. Thanks. Mom, is dad ever gonna be, well, dad? Yeah, mom. Yeah, he's different. I don't know, kids. I hope so. 
I guess time will tell. Well, let's get decorating the Christmas tree. Without Dad? I think this year without Dad, guys, yep. Okay. Alright. Okay, Mom. The end! Thanks for watching! To join all the fun up in our treetop, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go bananas for monkey in a